Hi guys, it's Mr. Holding here, and this quick video just shows you how I want you to do your diagram um, for the Ohm's Law. Now you'll notice here it says draw a labelled circuit diagram. So you're not a picture, you're after a circuit diagram, so something like this. Okay, you've got the cell, um, you've got the globe, you've got the connecting wires. Okay, in this case I've drawn a little example here. Now this is not what you're doing because we're not doing bulbs. Okay, in ours we're actually doing resistors, so obviously you have to draw yours accordingly, but this will give you the right idea. So, um, first of all, we undo the circuit. Okay, so in this circuit we've got our cell, um, we've got a switch here, and we've got a globe, okay, which is obviously different to the one that you're doing, but good for an example. I also want, I want to measure the current, so as you know, we have to put the, um, the ammeter in series, okay, because it has to have the current flowing through it. Right, and if I want to measure the voltage of a particular thing, it might be the voltage across the switch, it might be the voltage across the um, globe, I need to go uh, connected in series on either side, uh, in parallel, sorry, in either side of that. So you'll notice that my voltmeter is connected in parallel with one connection on one side of the bulb and the other on the other side. So that's specifically measuring the voltage across the globe or the potential difference. All right, as I said at the start, you need to do this for your circuit with a resistor, not this one, okay, because this one's not, this is just an example, but hopefully this gives you an indication of what you need to do. All right, hope this helps.